participants well our third week. I want to congratulate you all on your outstanding work on the Queen's Banquet Hall last week. Your websites were amazing. And for those of you who weren't able to watch us back home, make sure to tune in to our YouTube channel and subscribe, Top Branding TV, to make sure to see more of our behind the scenes and some extras that we got for you. We want to remind our audience that the winner of this season will take a prize package valued of $10,000. Can you guess who the winner will be? Okay, participants, this week I'm delighted to announce who you will be working for. That's right, can you take a guess? I'm wearing a divine dress from Glitz and Glamour. That's right, this week you will be working for the famous Glitz and Glamour formal wear. You will be creating two commercials for them. Now your first assignment is to create a 30 second commercial promoting the Imagine 6 event. And your second is to create a one minute video promoting prom. Inviting young ladies to come to Glitz and Glamour to find that unique dress for their special day. For this one, remember, you only have 48 hours to produce it. But before I send you off, I want to introduce you to the beautiful Esmeralda Valle, the owner of this beautiful place. Ms. Valle, would you please come delight us with your presence? Yes, thank you. Thank you for inviting me. How exciting to be here in your beautiful no, store. Oh, it's great to well, see first, you. first, I want to congratulate you for this beautiful store, Glitz and Glamour, and second of all, to thank you for giving this thank great you. opportunity to all the participants of Top Branding TV. Well, would you please tell us a little bit about your vision on Glitz and Glamour? Well, my vision on Glitz and Glamour basically came from a, from a dream that I had when I was a little girl. Uh, I always dreamed about dresses and glitzy stuff and glittery stuff, so what girl doesn't, right? But my dream actually came true and uh, I've been very blessed and uh, for that reason is the reason why I decided to, you know, do something for our community and for the girls from, from the Rio Grande Valley. Well, like you said that this is such a special story that dreams do come true and also yes. want to let the girls here in the RGB know that you are having an upcoming competition for Glitz yes. and Glamour. So exciting. I remember I was part of it the first yes, year and now it's your you sixth were. year. <laughs> Congratulations. Yes. It's such yes. a unique opportunity. Can you please tell us a little bit more of how you started? Yes, of course. Well, you do know what it's all about, but let me let you guys in on on our little secret of, of our event, right, of Imagine. Imagine is basically uh, an event that we do for the community, uh, for the girls here that want to, to become models or are interested in, in this type of world, right? Um, it all started with a little girl that came in uh, a couple of years ago, uh, maybe eight years ago and uh, she she came in and she wanted to be a model and uh, she said uh, to me that she wanted to be noticed by designers from new york and from los angeles and from paris she just had this huge dream right um, but financially she knew that her parents couldn't help her you know to make her dream come true mm -hmm. so i said you know what let me make a couple of phone calls and let me talk to some of the designers that I do know and see in what way we can we can make your dream come true. Mm -hmm. And uh, I talked to a couple of designers, Giovanni, Tony Bowles, uh, you know, uh, McDougal, and they all, um, they all were very sweet and very nice. All of them, all of my designers that I represent here at my store have totally been supportive. They have helped me to make this girl's dreams come true. And the way they have done this is because they told me, Esmer, um, you do your event and your winner, of course, will will come and model for us. So they get the experience, you know, they get the experience to go to Atlanta, to New York or Las Vegas or Los Angeles, wherever, you know, th they are required to go. Well, that's very interesting. You have a, such a kind heart. And I heard that there's something different this year than the competition. Would you like to tell us more about that? Yes, as a matter of fact, uh, this year, we it's the first year that we're actually doing the Little Miss and the Junior wow. Miss. So it's totally, totally new for us, but we're very excited that we're gonna have a wonderful, wonderful event. And uh, the girls that were chosen, I'm very proud of them. 
they're all very great little girls and hopefully this year it would be oh, something it's gonna turn out amazing yes amazing it. her events are so amazing and well for those of you who weren't able to participate this year stay tuned for the next and we'll once again thank you miss fire and if you heard it from the very best uh, you need to stop by to Glitz and Glamour and check out her beautiful store. And participants, you only have 20 minutes to choose the gorgeous gown from Glitz and Glamour. Ready? Go! Hey parents, no need for your kids to be bored in the backyard anymore. The word in the neighborhood is out, and kids are quickly running to the ultimate backyard experience in South Texas. Backyards Unlimited. Picture your kids jumping high with excitement with their very own backyard trampoline. Or creating lasting memories in the many unique play sets. It's sure to be a swing of a time for the whole family regardless of age. And with 20 years as a family run business, Backyards Unlimited not only makes it easy and affordable with available financing, but treats you just like family with excellent customer service. Backyards Unlimited, creating childhood memories one backyard at a time. Griselda, Gabby, and Elma, the Glam Squad hair and makeup artistry team. On one hand, Griselda and Elma help bring out the glow in their clients with makeup and hairstyle for any occasion. We are here to make your event special. On the other hand, Gabby focuses on bringing confidence and radiance to each of her clients by providing hair services of all kinds. I assure you, you are in great hands. And assured you should be, because Glam Squad is all about customer service. No more waiting like at other places. Here, it's all appointment based, so you will be treated promptly and adequately, just like you deserve. And all you have to do is relax and enjoy. But don't just take my word for it. Book your appointment today at 956-789-0025 and bring out the glow in you. Attention, if you have a creative soul and your field is marketing, filmmaking, graphic designing, or even broadcasting, we are now looking for Top Running TV Season 2 participants, which means more prizes, more episodes, more cash, and a different and limiting process. Make sure to visit our website and contact us www.topwritingtv.com There we go. Oh, I'm still recording, I think. Inside a glass case of emotions. Look at this. Wait, I can do like the... The, you know who I hate the most guys <laughs> do it. <laughs> All right, so if anybody is um, annoying me in this whole, I guess, show situation thing, it's, um, uh, I don't know, maybe uh, Fernando. I had a little run with him the other day. Just, uh, he's nice. He's a cool kid. He's just, oh my God, he just, he brings random people over. It's like, hey guys, like, here are my friends. And, this is like, I don't even know, I don't even know how to, how to spawn that, so, yeah, it's, I think, maybe him. I don't hate anyone, but, like, I do feel like people are really annoying. I feel like Elias is so, pick me, pick me. Like, the whole, um, and, like, when the, when we were commenting about the Queen's Gallery, and he was like, oh, I didn't say anything, it's like, bro, we know that you didn't say anything, like, why are you talking? <laughs> Hello participants, you have already chosen the dresses that you want to use for your commercial and had time to film your shots. 
Before I sit with you individually, I want to remind everyone how you will be judged this week. You need to have a clear business and buyer advertisement. Remember, your videos would be used for social media as well as TV advertisement. You will need to have a storyboard along with a full script of your assignments. Remember, we want to see something out of this world. Let's get started. Let me meet the first team. Bro, just wait till you try the acai and the batayo ball. What, 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 what? You'll see. Earthborn Juice Blance Bowls, now open in McAllen, Texas. So how do you feel, huh? Earthborn, baby. To all business owners and organization leaders, if you want to be part of Top Writing Season 2 and want our participants to work on your next social media campaigns or any advertising work, make sure to contact us and visit our website www.topwritingtv.com. Hey guys, how are you guys feeling? Are you guys excited? Quite nervous. Quite nervous? A little bit excited. How are you guys going to feel if you get eliminated today? Don't ask me that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't ask that. Well, best of luck. You guys go do great. Thank you. Devon Smithkamp. John Sertuche. Giselle Villarreal Mascarenas. Dr. Nick Taylor. Hello, everyone. Here I have some presentations ready for you guys to see. Thank you. I'm Alan, he's Fernando, we're Airglass, Airglass Agency. Agency. And today we're going to be talking about this presentation we put together for you guys, Glitz and Glamour. So before we start, what the Glitz and Glamour wanted to do was more exposure of selling prom dresses, of the prom uh, dresses, so they can, people can know, they can have more customers going and specifically buying for uh, prom dresses. So we both decided where, where we thought it was like, okay, there is prom king, there's prom queen and prom, so why don't we do like best prom award? And I think it's very interesting and uh, uh, very exciting because you go to prom, a lot of people want to win best king, best prom queen, but then you also want to win another, another kind of award. So we both decided, well, why don't we do best prom award? And I think it will be uh, such an awesome idea if you actually win a uh, best prom award and you get to tell them that it's from Glitz and Glamour. The best so, dress award. Yeah, the best prom dress award. So this mm -hmm. is where we have, the idea we have is having these three girls having a prom. There is a main model who, is, who comes from Glitz and Glamour and the other was where we scouted the talent from two other girls. And just like I had said and repeated many times, is that we had the three nominees presenting their dresses in front of everyone, in front of the student, teachers, like in the whole staff, like if they were in, in prom already having fun. And that's where we have who's going to win the best prom dress award. And at the end of the video, the girl who is the main mo model from Glitz and Glamour is winning the best prom dress award because there, there's already best uh, the, the queen, the king. So now we want to do something different where let's see who's going to win the best prom dress award. At the bottom of the ocean I'm at the bottom of the sea
But I don't know if I'll make it back home I'm just stuck here in a dream But I'm at the bottom of the ocean I'm at the bottom of the sea But I don't know if I'll make it back home I'm just stuck here in a dream Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We present with our three nominees running for the Best Prom Dress Award, directly from Glitz and Glamour, located on 2109 South 10th Street, Suite 20 in McAllen, Texas. And the winner is... So, I feel like on the commercial about the them being at Plum, well, I didn't believe it mm -hmm. because they're in a store with a whole bunch of dresses in the background. Mm -hmm. So I think that if you would have had more time and you would have used the time that was allocated to you, I think you could have gotten angles that was just on the runway that would not have shown any dresses and it would have been more believable. They would have been closer shots. They would have been about the girls, about the dresses, but it would have, because I didn't believe, I, I was kind of confused. I mean, mm -hmm. I heard your presentation, so mm -hmm. I knew where we were supposed to go, yeah. but I didn't believe it. Mm -hmm. So I think you should have used the second day, and just advice is when you are allocated two days, four days for a project, you don't just use a day. You use every single minute, because that gives you more time to, for the detail. You know, for you to like look outside yourself and go, okay, what are, what, what am I trying to portray, and, and is it believable? Because at the end of the day, I I could, it wasn't prom, it was a it was a store. I love that thing, man. That was a beautiful commercial. Get rid of the VO, and dude, you got a, you got something that's tough. And so those girls when they're dancing around, I'm telling you, I mean, I want to jump in there and woo, me too. I mean, I don't want to wear a dress, but <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, I want to have fun with it. So let's bring out the dapper gents. Uh oh, walking right now. Are you guys nervous? No, no not at all? Yeah, we're good. We're good. Did you guys prepare for this judging? Uh, about as well yeah. as you expect. Yes? You know I mean? All right, well, best of luck. Cool. You got your blindfolded cigarette? It's <laughs> good news. <laughs> hey, judges, what's going on? What's going on? Hi. And the people from Glitz and Glamour. What are you guys doing? It's a lot of them today. <laughs> Hi, what's going on? So, uh, yeah, we are officially rebranded ourselves as the Dapper Gentlemen. Is it? It's good facial hair. He has amazing hair too. Yeah, so. I think you guys have that Very dapper. Going on. Very dapper indeed. Minus <laughs> the scream shirt and the whiskey t-shirt. So, like you know what I mean? But yes, uh, and considering that, you know, we're kind of smelly dudes, and we did some stuff for glitz and glamour. We had a lot of fun with that one. It was a little bit nerve-wracking because it's not, you know, it's not with our wheelhouse, but it turned out a lot of fun with it. I think because of the, you know, I'm not exactly one to go get prom dresses for myself. It was. I think that made it. Like, Here's the first one we're doing. This is a 60 second prom video and enjoy. It's prom and the spotlight's on you. You're going to remember this day for the rest of your life. And if you hate your dress, you're gonna remember it always. So why take that chance? This prom season, come to Glitz and Glamour in McAllen. Glitz and Glamour's experienced staff will put you in the perfect dress for prom. And there's so many to choose from. No matter your style, no matter your taste, we'll find the perfect one just for you. And when you find that perfect dress, you're gonna feel amazing. Memories you'll cherish for the rest of your life start with Glitz and Glamour. This prom season, come to Glitz and Glamour in McAllen. Glitz and Glamour, 2109 South 10th Street in McAllen. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Instagram. All right, guys, I really liked your 30-second spot. I thought that was really good. Um, really unique. I like the way that you uh, framed the sign here so you could read everything and it's natural to the store as opposed to just using a pre-made graphic and overlaying it on yeah. the screen. So I think that that was really, really great use of the space. Uh, agreed about the pan shots. I think those were a little bit slow. Um, and aside from that, I, I think it was uh, it was simple. It told a story. Um, I like your 30 second more than your minute, uh, just in regards to the story that it did yeah. tell. Um, 
I think it's clean, simple to the point. It shows the the store. It shows some dresses. I agree. You could have probably showed off those dresses on your model a little bit more mm -hmm. um, to achieve a better effect. Obviously, she's a beautiful woman, so you know, put her in those dresses and let people pretend to be her, right? Yeah. As opposed to just showing them there on the rack. It does get a little flat. Um, other than that, I, I thought that the, aside from the kind of oversaturated last shot <laughs> yeah. being white. 90% of it was, was really great, uh, cinematography wise, looked really good, stitched together nicely, and uh, voiceover was clean. Yeah, that's I think one of my the favorite aspects of this show, just like getting outside of our comfort zone, was not just with the shooting that, but I'm more to the you know creative and the you know, marketing aspect of it. Never really held a camera in my life, and this is fun. I actually feel like I'm a little bit more comfortable doing it. Like, yeah, of course, it's a little bit of a novice at it, but I enjoyed it. I think it's really cool, and I appreciate the the feedbacks and eventually in the future, hopefully I can do a better job. Hey guys, are you guys excited? Yes. yes. A little bit nervous? Uh, a little. Yes. How would you feel if you feel eliminated today? Uh, we won't. No? Yeah. All right. That's the spirit. Well, good luck, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, guys. We're Spark Agency. This is Carlos, and I'm Amanda. Today, we're going to show you what we did for Glitz and Gummer. So we're going to go ahead and start with um, our research. So first and foremost, we started off with their social media pages. Um, Everything was super positive. There was a lot of good feedback on their dresses and a lot of experience. They have um, a good clientele so far. It's been open for a couple of years already. So they have a lot of followers on Instagram. So that was good growth that we already had to fall back on. Um, so we just wanted to go and emphasize more on like the variety of the dresses and that it wasn't just for pageants, that it was also for weddings and that they have a lot to choose from. Presentations there. I really dig the fact that you guys do storyboards. I love it. Good job. Um, the information is there. I wish there was more information about the registration portion, but the information on how to locate them and get them on Facebook is there. Um, I know you got shots. I know you can get me some more shots, some cool ones. I don't know why you reuse them. <coughs> so next time, for sure, get some more. Even though, even if you're not going to use them, just get them. You know, extra. You can keep them. Um, other than that, I really liked it. I think it was good. It was poppy. It was real. I love it. Yeah, good job. So let's bring up Branding House Agency. So guys, are you guys excited today? Yes, we are. How are you guys feeling? I'm doing well. A little bit nervous, excited? Yes, a little bit All anxious. right, how'd you feel if you get eliminated today? I'm going to feel a bit uh, distressed about it. How about you, Eliana? I feel like I'm just really excited to see what the judges think of our hard work. Well, that's the spirit. Good luck, guys. All right, thank you. Hey guys, I'm Damien Gonzalez. And I'm Ileana Moreno. Yep, we're Team Branding House. Um, today we're going to present to you um, what we've been working on for um, Glitz and Glamour. Okay, first we're going to watch the Imagine 6 event commercial, and um, after that we're going to watch the Glitz and Glamour 1 minute commercial. The Imagine 6 is the, uh, the event that they had. It's a 30 second commercial. That's what we were told to do. And we wanted to use one of their models to really promote the event.
Glitz and Glamour, we strive to give you the best service in finding the perfect dress for your event. From weddings to pageants to prom, we've got you covered. Glitz and Glamour has the perfect dresses to make your night one to remember. To make an appointment, call 956-630-4948 or stop by our boutique at 2109 South 10th Street in McAllen. The one minute commercial, I, I liked, I liked her excitement. So emotionally I connected with, oh my gosh, she's so excited. She's gonna wear a glitz and glamour dress and she's really excited about it. So I mean, it was, it was good, it was good. Thank you. The time of presenting to the judges is finally here. I just wanna wish all the participants good luck. Remember, to see who wins this week's assignment, you'd have to visit our YouTube channel.